Hi, I need some advice. There is no more light on my THM5320R panel, no signal is flashing on my thermostat, the fan of my heating is on and works so there is electricity present but the heating does not work. All the fuses in my electrical panel are okay. What do you think is the problem? What happened just before your thermostat displayed this message? Nothing. It is getting cold outside and we need heating. How long has this been going on with your thermostat? What have you tried so far? I don't know. We woke up this morning and it was not heating. Anything else we should know to help you best? No. Hi, my name is Mike. I have accepted your question and will be happy to help you. Please note my hours are 6.30 p.m. to 5 a.m. MST, Mountain Standard Time. If you reach me within that time frame I should be able to immediately respond. Outside of that time frame my response will likely be much longer. Please reply to this message so we can get started. Thanks so much. Mike smile this is a general answer in the meantime the first step to fixing most issues like this is to do a hard restart on your system. Power the unit off at the breaker for 15 minutes then power it back on. Let me know how that goes and then get back to me here if you need and further assistance. Thanks. I'll try that right away. Customer Attachment October 29, 2021 53 and 11 seconds a.m. Still no sign of power in the system. Okay, now we need to find where you are losing power. At the disconnect for the unit do you have fuses? Where? Where is the disconnect? Should be located near the UN at the power wires will run to the unit from the disconnect. Customer attachment October 29th, 2022 of 4 and 19 seconds a.m. Customer attachment October 29th, 2022 of 4 and 41 seconds a.m. In the furnace. Customer attachment October 29th, 2022 of 6 and 8 seconds a.m. Customer Attachment October 29, 2022 of 6 and 20 seconds a.m. The purple fuse seems fine. Should there be power if I test the wires? Which one should I test? The fuse is fine. Just tested. Hello? Okay as the power enters the unit from the power source let's look at the first component that has a wired connection. Need to check for voltage there. Also check for voltage at the control module at its power source. If you have power entering the control module and nothing is happening that whole module will need to be replaced. Thank you. You're welcome. Indeed, it still doesn't work. I need help. Hello, my name is Billy. Let's start with basics. The furnace you have will have a blinking light on the circuit board. Can you tell me furnace model number and what the blink pattern is? Hi, sorry for the delay. I order a new electronic board but it still doesn't work. Bah. Light blinks three long and three short. Do you know what it means? Yes, this means the limit switch is open in the furnace. Please remove doors to furnace and take pics and post here and I can circle what you need to do. There is no power on my post that should go to the Honeywell controller. 
See here, https colon slash billyfots.tinytake.com slash tt slash and june my of 8 cent 2 knee 3 now also tape down the pop out door switch. Okay tape down the black door switch but what do you mean by tap this switch 3 to 4 times? Did you get my pick with the arrows? It is a flat plate dot on the back side is a thermal disc. It gets hot and opens, 33, and when cooled it resets. We want to tap it briskly and see if it resets. Ah. Uh. Okay I'll try. That is just the first start point dot if not successful we check other limits. No it didn't change anything. Next try. Still blinking three long then three short. Now just to make sure dot power off dot remove the two wires dot hold the wires metal to metal and check code. This with the wires not even on the plate. Which wires? The two reds. Correct out the two wires on the flat plate. No connected or not I get the same blinking. Ok put the wires back on. Now we follow the red wires. The wires leave the board and make stops at limits and finally return to board. Let's follow the reds to next switches and post a pic of the, the switch dot some have tiny reset buttons between the wires. Show me the switch as it goes to before heading back to circuit board. First stop. Where they go? Final stop to TH white post with all the wires. Is light solid or blinking? Blinking, three long then three short. Did you press the small tab between the wires on the switch on side of burner box? Wow. It worked. Blinking is now, one short three long. TH power is back to the controller. That's set to a secondary code. Now turn off power power back on tell me code. Could it be 12? One short and two long? Now it is just solid. Is zone panel lit? Which one is the zone panel? The heating doesn't start. But I can turn the fan on and off. Okay, so now we have zone panel power. Is light still solid? Set for heat and wait for damper to open. Wait 60 seconds. Now a red light open beside heat. The system started the fan but neither the gas burner nor the thermo pump run. Light is still solid. And all wires back where they belong? Oh. The gas burner is working now. I don't understand why it is not the thermo pump as it is only 0 Celsius outside. I've been told that the thermo pump should run from 15 C and up and the gas takes it when it goes colder. Excellent dot so really you just had a trip limit switch. Prob because the thermostat is set more than a few degrees higher than room dot when behind the gas furnace takes over. If you have a W2 terminal the thermostat can force the heat into gas because it thinks it is behind. What is a W2 terminal? Your system is set for stages. W1 equals first stage dot which would be heat pump W2 equals second stage. Gas furnace in this case if thermostat was set for 5 degrees higher than room temp, the W2 stage takes over because it thinks the first stage cannot keep up. I got it. On my thermostat, when I put it on heat, it is a normal process with my thermo pump. 
When I try and heat it goes to the gas burner. Man you're great. Thanks a lot. I am glad you got it going. Thanks so much for the pics. It makes it much easier. I wish you the best Billy. Billy you are a five stars. Thank you. I wish I would have gotten this earlier. But I am glad all worked out. Stay safe. Billy. I now have to try back my original electronic board. To see if it will still work and maybe return the one I just bought. There is a very good chance you did not need the new board. I just did not want to say it. The first tech I got didn't know what was the problem that's why I tried to solve it by myself until you helped me. Stay safe. You know what? I just tried the old card and it doesn't work. It blinks, two shorts and four longs. Louise. Wrong call the fuse was not on. All is good with the old card. I figured dot sorry you had to get that. However you did just pass heating 101. 55357 five, semicolon and number 56833. Thanks again 6, star. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.